Generally, the criminal offense of larceny conjures an image of one person making off with another's property. But in State v. Carswell, we explore whether escape with another's property is a prerequisite for larceny liability. Donald Morgan worked as a security guard at a Days Inn motel that was under construction. One morning, he discovered that multiple rooms had been broken into. In room 158, the air conditioner had been pried away from its base at the bottom of the window, but not removed. After notifying the police, Morgan kept watch over the rooms to see whether anyone returned. That night, Morgan saw Rex Carswell and a companion enter room 158, remove the air conditioner from the window, and put it on the floor approximately five inches closer to the door, and leave it there as they left the room. Morgan then stopped Carswell and his companion as they were entering another room. Carswell was charged with breaking and entering, and larceny. At trial, he argued, among other things, that the slight movement of the air conditioner wasn't sufficient to satisfy larceny's taking and carrying away elements. Carswell was convicted of both offenses, but the state appeals court reversed the larceny conviction, agreeing with Carswell that the taking and carrying away elements of larceny weren't satisfied. The North Carolina Supreme Court granted review.